Is Samsung finally catching up with the Android 15 update? It sure seems that way. After months of waiting since Google first brought Android 15 to Pixel devices, Samsung is now starting to release its customized version, One UI 7. This update is first showing up on some of Samsung's top-of-the-line phones like the Galaxy S24, S24+, Plus, S24 Ultra, Z Fold 6, and Z Flip 6. But hope exactly is getting it first. Well, those who joined Samsung's beta program are in luck. If you were part of the beta testing, chances are high that the final version is already available for you. These users usually receive updates quicker than others no matter which country they're in. All they need to do is check for a small over-the-air update, and it's ready to install. For non-BA users in South Korea, One UI 7 has also started rolling out, but with a much larger file size. That's because it includes all the features and improvements packed into one complete update. In Europe, things are a bit unpredictable. Some countries often get Samsung updates earlier than others, so depending on where you live, One UI 7 might already be waiting for you or it could still take a couple more days. In the United States, however, the rollout is usually a little slower. Users there might have to wait another week or two before they see the update hit their phones. One surprise is that the Galaxy S24 FE hasn't been included in the first batch, even though it's part of the S24 lineup. Meanwhile, a special regional version of the Galaxy Z Fold is already receiving one UI 7 along with the Fold 6. It's a bit unexpected, but Samsung has always had a unique approach to how it delivers updates to different models. Now looking ahead, Samsung has a rough schedule for the next group of devices set to get one UI 7. If everything stays on track, late April should bring updates to more phones. These include the Galaxy Z Fold 5, Z Flip 5, S23, S23 Plus, S23 Ultra, and even the S24 FE. Also on the list are tablets like the Galaxy Tab S10 Plus and Tab S10 Ultra. So if you own any of those devices, you could be just a few weeks away from getting the update. Moving into May, Samsung plans to cover even more models. That includes older foldables like the Galaxy Z Fold 4 and Z Flip 4, as well as tablets and the Galaxy Tab S9 family. You could also expect one UI 7 to reach older flagship phones such as the S22 series, the Galaxy S23 FE, and the S21 lineup. Mid-range phones like the Galaxy A34 and A35 are expected to get it too. Even older tablets like the Tab S8 series and some region-specific phones like the Quantum Line are likely to receive it in that month. By the time June rolls around, the final wave of updates should begin. That includes phones like the Galaxy S73, a 53, a 33, a 25, a 24, and a 15. Budget-friendly tablets such as the Galaxy Tab A9, Tab A9 Plus, and even Samsung's rugged Tab Active devices are also part of that list. Regional models like the Galaxy Wide 7, Jump Series, and Buddy 3 are expected to follow. If your device wasn't mentioned, you might have to stick with Android 14 a little longer. And with how quickly things are moving, Samsung might launch the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Z Flip 7 before some current models even get the new update. Those future phones will likely come with one UI 8 based on Android 16, which shows just how fast the cycle is moving for newer flagships. Thanks for watching. If you found this helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more updates just like this.